Hiya, thanks for watching. I've just set up a tarp tent. I had to use a ridge line because I've got a hiking pole. Just got some stew on there as well. Yeah, I'll give you a look around now. Yeah, I've got the, the ridge line going through the top loop there, so it's suspended and pegged in. I'll show you inside. Plenty of room in there, you could probably get two people in there for an overnighter. Just got it tied up with uh, two taut line hitches and tighten the line. Nice day today. The only problem is there's loads of horse flies about. Yeah, I've just got um, a simple stew on the way there. I'm using the Tom Shoe Titanium alcohol stove as well. Yeah, it's just um, onions, carrots, potatoes. And I'm going to fry some mints up as well, some lean steak mints, throw that in as well. So, yeah, that's scouse. It's a simple um, stew. Right then. Yeah, I'm moving around because horse flies are trying to land on me. Bit of a nightmare. Don't mind that, but when it's them big horse flies, totally different. Yeah, not a bad little setup, really. I might use this for an overnighter the next few weeks, but I might choose a different place because. The horse flies are just ridiculous. Just give us a pan round. Yeah, they're quite hidden here as well. With all the hills, provide some shelter. Nice little stump as well to cook on. Loads of room in here for one. Probably get two in there as well. A bit cramped light, but you could get two people in there. Bloody horse flies. Spiders have moved in already. Just getting the statements on now. That's still stewing away because it was hot when I took it off, so the veg will still be cooking away there. Just saves time. Yeah, I'm just making scouse. It's um, a simple stew, popular with um, scousers. That's where they got the name from, people in Liverpool. I think it started in the docks. People, um, I think it was people from Norway that brought it into the city. And it just took on from there. But yeah, it's just a simple stew of um, carrots, onions, potatoes, beef stock, and um, cheap cut to meat, cheap beef or mints, that kind of stuff. Some people add a bit of corned beef as well. But yeah, I said I'd make this uh, a while back. Bounders asked me to make it. Uh, William Boundy, he's got a good channel as well. Like stick it out, go to some, some nice places, cooking outdoors and stuff. So yeah. This one's for him. It's 
have an oxo to it as well. Yeah, it's a very cheap and simple stew, but it tastes nice, especially out here. Yeah, I think it started off on the docks, Liverpool docks. People um, working on the ships and stuff wanted a quick and easy, simple one pot meal. And that's where it come from. Yeah, and people in Liverpool still eat it now. It's a popular dish. Even um, when you go to watch Liverpool at half time, they sell scouse pies. It's just um, meat, potato, carrots, and onions. Lovely day today. Yeah, I spotted a lot of fungi before as well, at the start of the video. I mean, something I want to learn more about, so I'm not sure what everything was, but I think there was a few poisonous ones there. That white one looked a bit like a, a death cap. I'm not sure if it was or not, but like a white olivey colour. Like it come out of a sack at the bottom and it had the ring around the middle and stuff. I'm not really sure, but someone might, might know if you do. Just leave a comment on some of the others as well. coming on nicely now that you might have noticed that I changed stoves as well come back to um, the Lixada alcohol stove that's the Tom Shoe titanium stove there yeah it was eating the fuel so I'm glad I brought that one with me now to be honest so um, you get more more time cooking with that one it's actually my, um, my favourite stove to be honest I prefer the Lixada over a Tranger It's going to taste nice, that. Hear the birds. Peaceful today, yeah. Yeah, they used all fresh ingredients today as well. Fresh carrots, potatoes, onions, nothing out of a tin. It's been boiling away now for some time. I think I'll just let the fuel run out. I think it always tastes best too if it's been um, cooking away for a good while really. No point rushing it. Just sit off air, wait for it to cook. I'll just eat it out of the pan. Took it off the heat. It's done now. The potatoes are starting to dissolve. Just had a little taste of it. It is nice, delicious. Some little taste now. Spot on that. Just going to add some HP sauce. Houses of Parliament sauce. 
It's named after the Houses of Parliament when it was invented in the 1800s. The person who invented the sauce found out that they'd be using it in the Houses of Parliament. So we called it HP. That's why there's always a picture of the Houses of Parliament on HP sauce. There's a little fact for you there. Everyone probably knows it. Well, I can honestly say that was the nicest meal I've enjoyed outdoors this year. So simple, but delicious. <clears throat> I think I'll just chill out here for a bit now. Might get me a down in my teepee. Wiped after that. I usually enjoy it with bread and butter, but I had to shift all that, so left it out today. But it is nice with the HP sauce as well. <clears throat> 